Hey everybody, here's a real quick light speed tip. I'm going to show you how to add a web link button to your sales register uh, just to allow your staff to be able to click through to uh, you know any important uh, page that they might need to get to during, uh, during a sale. Just quick easy access. Uh, so come on over here to settings. Let's go down to the custom menus and we're going to make sure that we're in the sales tab and we're going to go ahead and add a button and let's uh, let's go ahead and call this one sales policy sales policy and we're going to go ahead and have this open the web uh, web page uh, and then of course we can go here and give it a color uh, and put it into whatever position we want it to hop into here so right after the labor button is fine and we'll add that button to menu now uh, let's go ahead and go over and edit this button and just put in the URL. In this case, I'm just going to use Google, but this would be, uh, you know, a link to the to your website um, that shows the sales policy. And also, uh, it's a pretty good idea to open this in a new tab, uh, just so that you don't lose your uh, sales register. Uh, I always just do it out of habit. You can do it however you want, though. Go ahead and save changes. And now we're going to hop back over here, and just to show you a couple other. Uh, hypothetical things that you might be able to uh, add buttons for. Uh, let's say you have a, an eBay merchant account and uh, the guys sometimes need to hop over to cross-reference uh, a, a listing to a price in Lightspeed system. Uh, that can happen. Let's go ahead and make that blue. And then we'll just have to go in here and put in your link to your eBay account. And of course, I didn't do what I just told you that you should do. And let's have that open a new tab. Go ahead and save that. Go back over here. And let's just real quick add one for Amazon. Open web page. And we'll go ahead and give that a uh, green color. And of course, we'll scroll down. Go into the edit section of Amazon. Add the Amazon Merchant Account uh, web uh, URL and we're gonna have that open a new tab as well and let's just hit save changes now you should be able to see that there are three new buttons uh, in this screen so let's go over and see how that appears on the new sale so here's your sales register and you can see that there is a sales policy button eBay button and Amazon button so just click of a button and uh, your staff can get to where they need to real quick uh, there's a whole slew of things that you could use this for. It's become a really, really effective tool for me uh, and helping out uh, some of my clients as well. Uh, go ahead and leave a comment and let me know what you're using this tool for. Uh, and thanks for checking out this video.